Green trees brighten up our towns and cities. They provide attractive colour and life to a man-made environment. As well as providing a much-needed habitat for urban wildlife, they offer the urban population welcome shade in the heat of summer. For many people though, urban trees go unnoticed, simply blending in with other street furniture. But in reality, urban trees serve a far greater purpose than simply looking attractive. They are in fact helping to clean up air pollution by absorbing carbon dioxide and physically trapping airborne particles. If you imagine the surface area of a leaf and then double it to take into account both sides of the leaf and then try to imagine the overall leaf surface area of an entire tree, then you'll start to get an idea of the potential surface area that can capture airborne particles. Much of the particulate air pollution in urban areas comes from vehicle emissions, especially older diesel exhausts. Urban trees intercept an enormous amount of this particulate air pollution that could otherwise end up in the lungs of the urban population. Particles are divided into two groups according to their size, either PM10 or PM2.5. The smaller particles of the PM2.5 size range pose the greatest risk to health, as these are small enough to be inhaled deep into the lungs. Of course, there are all kinds of airborne particles, and they look very different under an electron microscope. Different tree species have different pollution capture rates. From my own studies, coniferous species seem to have higher capture rates for airborne particles. And some deciduous trees are great interceptors too, especially species that are slightly sticky, like lime. Evergreen foliage such as yew that has been densely planted into bushes can also act as a fabulous pollution barrier in traffic areas where vehicle exhausts are idling, such as near bus stops or traffic lights. Knowing exactly what and where to plant may help with the future planning of urban vegetation shelter belts to protect vulnerable members of the population, such as the elderly or the very young. Particles that are trapped on leaves are then washed to the floor with rainfall. As the seasons change, deciduous leaves eventually fall to the floor, along with their potential to cleanse the air. So. Urban trees serve a noble purpose. They are in fact beautiful biological filters, physically trapping airborne particles on their leaves, giving off oxygen and absorbing carbon dioxide. As well as brightening up towns and cities, they are silently refreshing the urban climate.